Hi, this is uh, Thunder with um, Greenland.com, where yes, uh, history in the making, we're showing a company that has the potential of uh, saving about uh, a billion dollars over a five-year plan with us nation, uh, globally. So, John, take it away. Okay, uh, I got over here, and the hoist that I was going to use tonight, uh, uh, they had to take it and use it on another project. But uh, we'll go ahead and take some reading. We'll start here uh, with the floor. Kind of reviewing a little bit. Uh, back on the third, when we first brought the holograms in here, we um, did some baseline readings before we actually brought them in or near the building. In this particular room, when we uh, read the chillers and the floors and the walls, our uh, average temperature in here was about uh, 30 degrees Fahrenheit to maybe, was it 34? I think it's some of the higher points we saw. Uh, but over the past 10 days or so, as, it, as we've had the holograms in here, we've seen a gradual trending down uh, in the temperature in here, uh, resulting in a decrease in the amount of energy required. So I'm going to switch over the camera here and uh, show you some readings, okay? Uh, this first one is uh, directly on the floor. Okay, nine degrees, eight degrees colder. Oops. Let me get over here where we typically read. Epic. Okay, so this one's 29. Let's give it just a second because I think the temperature is going to it'll vary here a little bit. Um, okay, it's about 30. Okay, let's uh, let me get up here uh, to the chiller. A little bit. Okay, well, just a second here. Okay. Since I don't have the hoist, we're shooting from down low. That's okay. That's pretty accurate. We're 27. Yeah. That's very accurate within a degree. Okay, uh, we've been shooting this uh, particular support over here. That was 27, 28. We're about still, what, about four or five degrees lower than what we were? No, we were at 37. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. Okay, we've been shooting this wall on a regular basis. Yeah, yeah, it's nine degrees total. Anyway. That one's 27. Then we've been shooting this one other wall over here. And drop. Awesome. Okay. And then we've been uh, going inside where they have the free cooling tunnels. Right. We, so we forgot to. Well, we forgot to mention that the. Glycol that's running through these uh, pipes is at 23 degrees uh, by the time it goes to the ammonia chillers. So we'll go in here and we're going to see uh, some uh, temperatures. Hold on a second. Where this is pushing down. Sometimes when I go in here, I lose signal, so let me just kind of preface it. I'll go in here. If you can hear me, I'll talk. If not, when I come back out, I'll tell you what the numbers were that I see uh, shooting at the wall, the floor, and up on the chiller. Copy. First person shooting the AO game here will have uh, live thermal activity. This is how we do our install. Wow. OK, 
Okay, could you see any of that video? Um, we got uh, one, almost only one second that you were on live, and we saw a six degree. What, what was going on there? Uh, that was shooting the floor. I was getting a six degree reading on the floor, a five degree reading on the uh, on the um, uh, on the wall, and then I was getting. And when I pointed it up towards the base of the chiller, I was getting three point two degrees. So I'm kind of curious if we've got a glycol going through there at twenty three degrees. How are we getting that cold? Um. That would be because of the uh, thermal pucks that are located near, or the uh, thermal pointies that are uh, located near that area of the building. It's got to be because there's no there's no other thing that's going on here that can cause right, that. Tough. The other the other night when Douglas and I got done talking, I came back through here and I traced all of the lines just to double confirm that the glycol. It's running through these chillers up in this room. Um, is that 23 degree uh, glycol? And it is. It's absolutely 100% 23 degrees that is the cooler cooling fluid for those chillers. But yet inside here, we're we're single digit. That's a uh, thermal anomaly in the cold storage industry, and this is what we are breaking here. At, um, .com. John, these are this is I'm, I'm speechless. Wow, this is awesome footage. Helps us show folks how we do our installs, our testing, knowing firsthand we're helping each rep right there along the way with our video conferencing system. So next one, this is uh, Thunder at Grayland.com.